We found that really businesses at all levels, local, regional, national, are going to have increased opportunities. One of the challenges is making sure that the businesses are connected with the opportunities that are most appropriate for them. Small businesses have some tremendous opportunities with the growth in Southwest Louisiana. They will also have some challenges. The growth, of course, is to have contracts with Sasol or the prime contractors or sub of a sub with Sasol and the other industrial developments or to build the new houses that are going to be occupied by people who are moving to southwest Louisiana, to provide the restaurant services, all the other things that people are going to want to buy. You still have to have capacity. One of the things that I tell my clients or anyone that I talk to about this is that you know you can position yourself if you understand what the opportunity is and perhaps you can collaborate. Collaborate with some other small businesses or maybe contact some of the, and we can help you with some of that, contact some of the, the prime or the subprime contractors and get a portion of that, of that particular project. They don't have to try to take on a major project by themselves. Sasol has stepped to the plate and is hosting or sponsoring the development of a small business resource guide. The small business resource guide is a document that explains step by step how to establish a small business, talks about the issues involved in running a small business, talks about setting up an LLC, talks about financial plans, insurance, many of the things that a small business owner needs to consider when they set up a small business. The C Center is certainly the best starting point for anyone who wants to know what's happening in the Southwest Louisiana area economically and particularly for a small business person. Because for many years we had a lot of services here, entrepreneurial training programs and other activities, but they were fragmented, they were kind of scattered. So now they can literally come to one place and really go from literally one office to another, getting the type of assistance that they need. So probably the biggest concern for small businesses is not so much the new opportunities, we believe they're going to have access to those, it's how do they keep the appropriate staffing levels, how are they able to retain the people they have, and how are they going to recruit new people. The one advantage that a small business has, no matter where they are, compared to some of the, the big global or large companies, is that they can what we call pivot very quickly. They can change to respond in markets and also they, they are in this market so they know the clientele quite well. They've established personal relationships. So those relationships that they build with their customers, their clients and with their employees we think can be used to their advantage. And by being able to react very quickly to something and not having some of the overhead maybe that some of the big companies have or where the decision making is maybe made somewhere else, they can make those decisions right here on the spot. Much like the general small businesses, when we spoke with minority small business owners and some of the minority leaders in our community, they wanted to make sure that the minority businesses had the same sort of opportunities to participate as other businesses. When we talked to some of the plants and some of the other contractors, they were very forthright with us in saying that all qualified businesses will be given an opportunity to participate because from the purchaser standpoint, the concern was more do we have enough vendors and suppliers and contractors than anything else. So they, they were very, very uh, clear in their message to us that anybody who's qualified to perform a service will probably be pushed to capacity um, over the next few years. Sasol and Floor are committed to using Vendor Vet, which is a program run by the Safety Council. It is a registration database for small businesses, a small business for $50 a year, which is a phenomenally low subscri subscription rate, can go in and register their company. They can put in what they do, what they sell, give, provide some information about their company. What I would say to any small business, any entrepreneur, whether someone is what we might call pre-startup, who maybe has an idea and just trying to decide what they want to do, or someone who's been operating for a while, give us a call. Give us a call here at the Sea Center. You can contact me here at the Sea Center, and we can be happy to meet with you and explain to you in more detail some of the opportunities that are here, some of the services that we have, and how we can tailor those to your needs. Because it's not a cookie cutter, one size fits all what we have here. We actually uh, serve the individual client to meet their particular needs. The economic mobility opportunities are going to exist throughout the business spectrum. 
every business that, that is remotely connected to industry or perhaps not even connected at all in terms of service and retail is going to have an opportunity to grow their business over the next few years. It, it will be a thriving economy and so those who plan well and position themselves to take advantage of that thriving opportunity really have a, a chance to grow and uh, increase their overall business.